Hey, what's up guys? Alex here. Thank you for checking this video and welcome to the last video of the series of tutorial on how to build a premium theme for WordPress. I can't believe I just said that. Don't panic, this is not the last video about WordPress tutorials, it's just like the conclusion of the series about the sunset theme, the series that we started almost a year ago, or like a little bit more than a year ago, and I published 65 videos, 65 tutorials in this specific series, and I think we reached a point where it's time to close a chapter and open another one. So I know that there are a lot of things missing from these tutorials. We didn't tackle any customization from the header part of the theme, like where the icon of the sunset theme and the introduction is written. Uh, we didn't create any specific unique options for pages or uh, for more uh, like other advanced things in the sunset administration areas we didn't complete the responsive part <laughs> like so we're missing a lot of things we didn't create a, a single custom template for the user to use in order to customize pages so the sunset theme is not completed at all it's like far beyond to be completed but i feel like at this point you have all the tools and all the knowledge in order to complete it by yourself you know how to create a custom admin area how to create custom meta boxes and custom options for posts and pages you know how to create a contact form and collect user data and save that user da data in custom fields so you have pretty much all the necessary knowledge in order to complete the theme by yourself you can polish the responsive part you can extend the custom options or you can package it and release it as it is by changing just a little bit of things and you also know how to create custom widgets so why not extending the footer area that right now it's completely empty and implementing a custom sidebar for that footer with custom widgets specifically for that area you can totally do that now you have the knowledge to do that from my end i feel like it's time to move on and i was feeling like i was dragging these a series a little bit too long and I don't feel like I have any more contributions about it and it's like kind of concluded so let's declare it concluded and move on to the next project so from next week I'm gonna start 100% focusing on completing the series about git that I started I think a year ago and then I stopped after two videos so I'm gonna do five videos all together, I'm gonna to try to release it one per day uh, about Git in order to complete uh, the Git series that is really simple, it is really short, especially like for the way I use Git. Like I don't use Git in a complex way, I don't use like all the nuances and all the commands, but uh, I wanna show you how I use it and I wanna show you how to properly use the most common commands of Git, the one, uh, those that you're gonna use pretty much every day in during the development process. After that, I'm gonna continue, of course, the um, recording and the releasing of the series about uh, sketch how to build a website how to design a website because I want to complete the design of my new website and I'm gonna to try to do more live streamings on me coding the website and then I'm gonna to try to do at the same time also live streaming of the website of Sabrina Miso that is my girlfriend I have to build her new website and I want to use AWPS, my custom theme that I'm building and releasing with all these cool stuff about like Composer, NPM, all namespaces and classes and customization built in WordPress. So I'm gonna show you how to use AWPS in a production ready project. So something that you can actually build, package and release fully completed and this should work absolutely. Over the next month I'm gonna release also some uh, uh, product reviews about the keyboard that I just bought, the WASD keyboard that it's like so sweet and it's amazing using it. Uh, I'm building a custom HTPC, a home theater personal computer and I want to show you all the pieces that I bought and why I bought all those pieces. I'm gonna try to be as technical as possible and I'm gonna show you the full process of uh, how you decide which 
parts you can use and which you can't and how to assemble together installing an operating system in my case I'm going to install Linux and how to configure it properly to uh, stream and watch Netflix and game on Steam or stuff all the stuff like that hopefully you're going to be interested in this new series and as a last announcement, and I think this one is going to get you a bit excited, from next month, right now we are in March, so starting from April, I'm going to start a new series about the plugin development of WordPress, the plugin development tutorials for WordPress. So we're going to start with like really simple plugin, like for example, a simple contact form in the sidebar or a simple like create a plugin to activate a widget and stuff like that. And then we're going to move to more and more complex plugins. So it's going to be an ongoing series that is going to go on for, I think a year. <laughs> I'm going to try to top up the number of tutorials that are released for the sunset theme with like more plugins and all those plugins, of course, I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to release them for free on GitHub. So you can actually download those plugins and use them on your project without even following my tutorials. But anyway, in conclusion, this was an amazing adventure. I started the sunset theme more than a year ago. I was probably at like 2000 subscribers and now I'm at 24,000. It's just like mind blowing. It's, it's getting better and better every day. I know I haven't been really consistent in the past month, but I've been like super, busy with my work and also super sick because the weather was awful and I don't have an immunitary system that works. My body is like really collapsing slowly, but it's fine. I'm going to be fine. So no worries. I'm going to keep publishing tutorials until I can't anymore. But other than that, just a gigantic thank you, just like a massive consistent, constant thank you to everyone. Without you, I wouldn't be here without all the audience that follow me through the process or even to you that you just saw this video or you're seeing this video right now and you never subscribe to my channel and you're wondering why this weird guy is thanking everyone like what what did you do like i don't know but thank you for watching this video it's amazing and thanks for your views and your support i was able to create this pretty good series that i think it was something missing in the internet community i really complete and understandable series on how to build a theme for WordPress. Not something that just 10 tutorials that you have to pay 20 bucks and are just like scattering information that they show you nothing. Instead, this is a complete series. We tackled everything and now you have the knowledge to build whatever theme you want. So hopefully it's gonna be awesome in the future. Thank you again. As usual, if you wanna support me, just like, subscribe, click the like button, check the support me page on my website. And other than that, all the love to you. I'm just like so grateful to be here. And this was an amazing journey. And the next one is going to be even more awesome. Thank you again. And as usual, happy coding. Definitely happy coding.